Krotnostra asks, I'm still confused. If Shanks is that strong, can toe-to-toe -to -toe with Whitebeard, even with a single arm, how can he easily lose his left hand to a Sea King? That is a very fair question, and that has two answers, one in-universe and one out-of-universe. In universe, the explanation is that Shanks at this point isn't as strong as he becomes when he's an emperor, and he's racing with all his might to just barely save Luffy from the Sea King at the very last second. And because he's using all his strength just to get there in time, he can't defend himself, and therefore, boom, the arm is gone. The out of universe explanation is that Oda originally planned One Piece to take about five years to complete. Luffy was going to get to the Grand Line, defeat the Four Emperors, and find the One Piece, and that was basically going to be that. When the story ended up going for over a quarter of a century instead, the power scaling ended up going way beyond what he had planned for in 1997. Most sufficiently long-running narratives will have these kinds of inconsistencies crop up over time. It's a big part of the reason why Western comics reboot themselves every few years. But thank God that One Piece will never do that. Knock on wood. Thanks for the question. <laughs>